I'm glad I can share this with the rest of the world. Uh, obviously, I've known for uh, quite some time and I'm happy that all my three uh, picks uh, were happy to take part and uh, be part of this journey. I mean, obviously, Laura, the icon, legend she is within uh, the game of golf, women's golf, and obviously all her accomplishments. Uh, you would definitely want to have her on, on your side and uh, be a part of the ringside team. I've been fortunate enough to play with her, uh, work alongside her, and I really enjoyed kind of uh, our work that we did over the last two Solheims, more on the, the captaincy part. So uh, she's very much uh, intrigued by this, and I, I know she loves it, and she, she wants to help out. Caroline is obviously one of my really good friends. Uh, I think it's great to share uh, a story like this uh, between the two of us, but she's also probably one of the most friendly, outgoing persons that I know. She has experience from the Ladies European Tour and she's a massive team player and she will give her heart out to make everyone feel comfortable. And I think that is almost as uh, important and I think between the other three of us we have enough Solheim Cup experience to kind of bring in someone with a little different uh, uh, flavor. I mean Anna is now the kind of leading player within the playing group. Uh, she's always has uh, seven Solheim Cups uh, in her back pocket. She has the experience, she also has the respect among the other players and the way kind of she played last year, it just proved to her that she wants to take that role. But I also see Anna as a potential captain down the road, and I want that. I know that she wants to have the experience and kind of know a little bit more what goes on behind the scenes, uh, which is quite different from when you just play. Um, so I want to, anyhow, I want her to be a part of uh, our team. And I mean, I've had fantastic memories and shared a lot of uh, fairways with her over my uh, career and. Uh, uh, she was a pretty obvious choice for me. From a team perspective, this is probably the best venue I've ever had. I mean, fantastic resort, hotel, golf course on site. I mean, I've been fortunate enough to come down here a few times now, getting to know the place, and I just love it. Um, uh, I think the course uh, has uh, challenging holes. I think it's going to be a good match play venue. And uh, from a spectator standpoint, uh, I mean, you can't beat these views. Uh, weather is most likely going to be fantastic as well. So uh, I think we will feel a Solheim Cup with a little Spanish vibe here, uh, which I love. Uh, and um, I can't wait for the rest of the world to kind of explore this fantastic uh, site. I mean, I'm pinching myself every day. I mean, this is for me uh, a very, very big honor. Um, I've always dreamed of maybe one day I could captain, but I don't know if you really believe it. Uh, but I always believe that dreaming big is, uh, kind of brings opportunities and uh, I'm going to try and do my absolute best and just try to facilitate the best I can for the team to just have the best week of their life. It's a really team effort and I, that I've really enjoyed over the years. I mean, the way the European golf just comes together uh, and kind of relish uh, a week like this, I think is going to benefit not just the venue here, but I think globally and especially European women's golf.